ca the cars making things even worse. Woodmont Street near Negley is already crumbling and Channel 11's Mike Holden got a closer look. At the bigger issue under the road. With the playground back here, folks in this Squirrel Hill community are extremely concerned. And that's because this sinkhole is forming right here where little kids frequently play and many people park. We've been telling our kids, you know, watch out, watch out, whatever. There's a hole here. Amanda McCoy is keeping an extra watch on her two year old daughter, Ruby, every time she rides her scooter in front of their Squirrel Hill home. She's on edge ever since her nine year old son fell deep into this sinkhole, injuring his entire leg. He was like, hyperventilating over excited about it because it was scary. It was late at night, fell into this big hole. The sinkhole is forming directly in front of their house on Woodmont Street. At first glance, it seemed like a small issue, but once she took a closer look, she realized it's at least five feet across and four feet deep under the street and the ground around it is cracking. There are three toddlers that live here. They're all about two, three years old. There's, this is a neighborhood. You know, we have plenty of families that are walking on the street. Then factor in tight street parking and the weight of cars on the road. Neighbors say it's only a matter of time before it expands or someone's car is seriously damaged. It goes way underneath there, right? So if you're parking there and it collapses, that's half your car in the sinkhole. In the interim, Amanda has taken matters into her own hands, covering that hole until there's a permanent fix. I reached out to the city of Pittsburgh, but a spokesperson said it's a PWSA issue. PWSA told Channel 11 they are going to secure the site tonight and begin the investigation of the sinkhole first thing tomorrow morning. Reporting in Squirrel Hill, Mike Holden, Channel 11 News.